Hey guys, welcome to a new week of The Rundown. On this episode, CNO has a message for Navy leaders. CMP is featured in a podcast. The Navy has a new mobile app, and we look at the leadership development framework. In response to the recent photo scandal, CNO released a message to Navy leaders asking them to get tough on actions by any sailor that degrades anyone. In the blog titled No Bystanders, CNO says that he expects leadership at all levels to make it clear to their sailors that those who do not display the character or cannot live up to the professional standards required of them are not welcome in the Navy. Demeaning activity is a threat to our core values, and CNO urges deck plate leaders to remove it from the ranks. You can read more on CNO's blog on the Navy Live website. Chief of Naval Personnel, Vice Admiral Robert Burke, made an appearance on Soundings, where he discussed Sailor 2025 and other personnel initiatives affecting the fleet. Soundings is the CNO's podcast with the latest news and policy from CNO's office. You can find the episode by clicking the podcast link on CNO's homepage. The Navy released a new free app that gives sailors access to approved Navy apps that have been released for mobile devices. It's called the Navy App Locker, and it acts as a one-stop shop so that sailors and their family members can access all the Navy apps in one central location. Sailors can use the App Locker to search for apps specific to their needs. From there, the App Locker will send users directly to the specific download on Google Play or iTunes. So far, the Navy has produced 18 mobile apps that provide training, resources, and tools for sailors, civilians, and family members. You can check out the website version of the app by visiting applocker.navy.mil. You can also get more information by reading the story on navy.mil. Finally, the Navy has released its Leader Development Framework Implementation Plan, designed to build operational excellence and stronger character in our Navy leaders. The framework places commands in charge of creating strategies to develop leaders at every level. CMP said that people are our asymmetric advantage and leaders at every level are vital to the success of our Navy. This is why the Navy must continue to train our sailors to be leaders who think clearly, learn rapidly, and exemplify character and integrity. Read more about the framework in NAVADMIN 060-17 and read the story on Navy.mil. Well, that's all for this week. For any questions, send us a message at usnpeople.fct at Navy.mil. For the Chief Naval Personnel, I'm MC2 LJ Burleson. Thanks for watching.